All right, guys, flavored tobacco ban is going into effect. It's actually happening. Uh, some people are saying it's December 21st because the CDTFA's um, Office of Finance, I believe, was going to be concurrent with the state. But their date was January 1st. Um, they might give you a week, two weeks, three weeks buffer just to unload your inventory, get yourself situated, get things off the shelves. But the end is near. So all the people that thought, oh, I thought it wasn't happening. They weren't going to do this. They are flavored tobacco is going into effect they are going to take them off the shelves you have to take them off the shelves and you only have to i believe have fda approved devices um, that you could sell to customers i would like to see how this plays out i don't know who's going to enforce it if it's going to be the city if it's going to be the state if they're going to form a separate task force but at the moment, it's my understanding that uh, Tobacco Enforcement Program, LAPD, um, you know, Labor Board and the ABC and all the health department, all these other agencies are being uh, organized to attack businesses uh, before, I believe, any, you know, I believe in a kind gesture. The sweet tongue gets the snake out of the hole. You know, I believe in talking to people, educating people. So if tobacco enforcement program, city attorney, council members, mayor, senator, assembly member, congressman really care about the immigrant businesses and care about the children, they should form an education process that educates the immigrant business owners, educates the parents, educates the children. For that reason, we will have better results. Because if the kids think it's cool to smoke shit, they're going to smoke it. If they think, you know, growing up, I didn't smoke. A lot of kids thought it was, you know, cool to smoke. So they smoked. They smoked whatever they smoked. Some regret it. Some still smoke. Some don't. But we didn't have flavored stuff back then. And people are going to end up telling me, oh, well, it was different then. You don't understand, Arnie. I, I, you know, go kick rocks. So focus on the children focus on the immigrant businesses we're gonna end up seeing a lot of small businesses close so let's see what happens deuces